autopilot in the rain. Let's see how Tesla's autopilot drives itself in this rainy weather. So right now the windshield wipers are on automatically and all I have to do is monitor the road. This is basic autopilot. So what it's doing is steering for me right now. The braking and the accelerating is happening as well. And my job is to simply sit back and monitor the road. Always have a hand nearby if you have to intervene, which is rare, and pay attention to the screen. Because occasionally in this basic autopilot, you're going to get messages like that. It says apply slight turning force. So it's really that simple. This is steering, doing the braking, the accelerating. And a lot of people ask, well, how much does this cost? How often do I have to use it? Well, first of all, it doesn't cost anything. Watch this truck slowing down. I'm not going to hit anything. That was actually really smooth. Looks like this road's closed, so the truck is going to turn right here. And my Tesla makes those adjustments. You don't have to use autopilot. It's convenient, like I just showed you. If you just want to sit back and relax and monitor the road, it doesn't cost anything, and it does the steering, braking, and accelerating. Now, it does not merge. That's different. That's full self-driving. If this light turned red, it would not stop. That's right, because this is basic autopilot. If I have to change lanes or stop for a traffic light, that's why you have to be aware. I would put my bra uh, foot on the brake and I would do that manually. So that's the biggest difference, but all in all, I mean, I use this all the time. It's really simple.